I had a pet mushroom. I put a name tag on him. I named him Pal. I want everyone to press F to pay respects to Pal because he was a troublemaker. He escaped my garden a few times. I would always bring him back with a little leash. Unfortunately, however, right before I filmed this, I noticed he escaped the garden again. I, I wandered around a bit, found him, but as I was leading him back to my garden, I he unfortunately fell off the cliff. I went around finding him, but then I obtained some meat, and that's how I knew it was all over. So yeah, rest in peace to my pet mushroom pal. We'll miss you. All right. Now we're gonna go out to my garden. This is where he used to live. This is where he kept escaping. I'm sorry, pal. This is my little... This is, welcome to the garden. Please stay on the path. I, I said not to go beyond. I don't know why I'm now welcoming them into my garden, which is clearly beyond the sign. But, um... This little path that I made out of dry kelp blocks. I grow some pumpkins, some bamboo, which, like, grew to its max overnight. Oh, it's raining. And, um... I grow a whole bunch of flowers, a bunch of melons. The rain's gonna make it lag more, I just know it. The lag is so bad. Those hold on, vines are overgrown. This happens every time I come out. I mean, every time I leave it alone, the vines just... All right, let's go back in my house where the rain won't make it lag. Hopefully. All right, there. Now, um... As you can see, I have cobwebs in the corners. The reason for this is because, I don't know, it's just my thing. Every single time I make any kind of house or base in games like Minecraft or Terraria, I always have to have cobwebs in all the corners. I really don't know what that is. I, I don't know. Um, over here, we have a little dispenser thing. Maybe it's just like some handy dandy items. My enchanting table, some redstone devices furnace crafting table and then this little chest over here let's open it you know let's take a take a lag break again again i need to stop i need to like stop sometimes so the lag doesn't make my thing crash it almost just crashed there all right we don't need to be on top of the chest now we open this. This is my random chest. It just has random items. Oh, wait. Yeah. If you're wondering why the name of this is Important 2, I was trying to name it Important to Remember, and then I hit Enter by accident. And it ended up like this. So ignore that. And yes, my Minecraft name is MCYT, as in Minecraft YouTuber Fan788. The reason for this is because I didn't realize when they told me to put a gamer tag, for, or like an Xbox gamer tag or whatever, th that was also my Minecraft username. And now I can't change it, but it's fine. Got the two famous discs, if you know, you know. Well, it's your messing pure reference there. Fireworks, don't know why I had those. N you know, snowball, slime ball, ender pearl, blazer art, tri trap chest, trap chest, in case I wanna, um, like prank someone, I don't know. Beacon. Yeah. I genuinely do not know what the stuff in that chest is even for most of it. As you can see I have glowstone on the stairs and um little dragon head. I have a lot of dragon heads everywhere. I don't know why. I figured I found out that you could place them and then I decided that's what I wanted to do. Just everywhere. As you can see there's magenta carpets on the stairs rather than pink because I decided I wanted more color variety. I was going to do every just everything pink originally. As you can see upstairs, though, I did end up with more variety. You know what? It's been a while. Lag break. Dun, 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 lag break. Or should I say lag break to avoid lag? While we have this little break, I'm going to eat cookie. A lot of them are broken. 
Happy early 4th of July to people who celebrate it. And to people who don't, don't worry. I love you anyway. As you can see, this is the little upstairs room. Again, I wanted more color variety, so I got these little in between the glowstone. Up here, it's mostly lighted by glowstone, as opposed to the downstairs where it's mostly, you know, torches. So I added a bunch of little color things in between the glowstone. I also have a pink candle over there. And then, these two beds, I was originally going to do them pink like the last ones, but I said, you know, I'll go green and blue. Again, more color variety. Um, little Steve Head. Is it called Steve Head or Player Head? Because the thing, it said Player Head, but it, it's Steve Head, right? Anyway, this is my pet bee. His name is Ernesto. Say hi, Ernesto. Yeah. All right, hold on, let's take a quick lag break. I'm gonna be the most annoying Minecraft YouTube channel ever because I've just hit stopping. Um, so how's your day, everybody? Oh, it wasn't good? It's okay, I'm here for you no matter what. All right, let's go back to the game. I don't know why I named him Ernesto. It was a very random choice of name. I told my little brother about it, and he said, wait, how did you think of that? That's a great name. Let me know if you guys agree with him. Speaking of my little brother, may as well pause while I talk. His channel, you can skip ahead this part if you want. Actually, no, please don't, it's important. Um, my little brother has a YouTube channel of his own. He recently posted a video which got f over 430 views, which is absolutely insane. He only has 12 subscribers, which for a kid who's just talented and awesome at making stuff as he is, he's better than me in a lot of things. That's ridiculous. Please go subscribe. Help him get a lot more. We're siblings, and I have hundreds more subscribers than he has. Please subscribe to me, too, though. The link to my brother's channel, Ransom Gamer, will be in the description. Thank you so much. All right, back to showing you. Now, listen, story time real quick. I was originally going to have a fish tank in this room rather than a little, a little bee. But I tried literally three times to make the fish tank, and each time, one of the glass things would break. Water would, would shoot everywhere. And I would have to replace all the carpet, because in Minecraft, um, when you place carpet on a block, and then pour water on it, it washes up the carpet. It's so annoying. I poured water on my carpet in real life, by accident, lots of times, and did it, like, wash away in a flood? No! Obviously, I didn't pour a whole bucket of water onto it, but, like, even if you pour a whole bucket of water onto a carpet, it won't wash away like that. You shouldn't have to replace carpet, but, like, I got sick of it and just went with a bee instead because bees don't require water, thankfully. My brother said that I should have, um, placed a beehive in there instead of just a bee so I could have more. And I should have thought of that. I don't know why I didn't. I didn't know beehives were a thing. Again, I'm a Minecraft noob. I really suck at this game. Okay, back to the tour. So, um... This, this little player head keeps him company. I'm just gonna call him Steve Heads. And then, um... Hold on, wait. Oh my goodness. It's raining through my scaffolding now! Okay, I have this little skylight thing. What is that called? The little... I don't know. Thing where you can see the night sky out of. Let's go up. It's raining. Okay. Um. Trying to get off the scaffolding. Okay. This is a little table we made out of dark oak slabs and dark oak. Put some pink banners up. And it's a little, I don't know why I put a table and chairs up here. I should have put one inside too, but I forgot to. I was going to. And hold on. 
This is a huge, I don't know if it looks like one, but it's supposed to be a big muffin. Yeah. By the way, tall bamboo <laughs> that I was growing in my garden. And yeah. I just realized I forgot if I already showed you guys the garden or not. I'll give you a quick peek of it from this angle. I thought for sure I did. Okay, yeah, I'm pretty sure I did. But yeah, little garden down there. Yes, yeah, so there's a gate, but I usually don't go in through the gate. And then, story time. I made a little, a little sapling farm. I just put sap. I was trying to be a little bonsai tree farm, and then I placed tree is on all the little saplings on all the little oak blocks. Not oak blocks. What am I saying? Dirt blocks. And then. But then they grew, and I was not intending for them to grow, so now they're full size. Help! I, I, I'm, it was, I was intending for this to be bonsai, or something. Um, we can work with this, though. This one is a late bloomer, has not started to grow yet. It's okay. It's okay, little Timmy. You'll grow soon. It'll be just like your family. Alright, let's take a quick lag break. And just admire the, the beauty and majesty of the Big Muffin. <laughs> why, why do I not know how to make these videos entertaining? Like I don't. You guys are not entertained right now. There's no way. All right, took a little lag break. As you can see, I made the executive decision to build my base near water. However, I also made the same decision to build it by a death trap. As you can see, like right over a death trap. In case you don't believe me, I'm gonna show ya. There's like, a, there's like a huge crack and I just built my base right over that crack. For real, I need to fill at least some of that in or like, or like block it over with grass blocks. I don't know what I'm doing, honestly. I need to fill some of that in. The thing is, though, it's gonna help with trespassers. Like if I don't want something in my base, I can just get rid of the slab bridge. But, um,. So let me know in the comments whether I should fill up some of it or not. Maybe I should just make the bridge a little bigger. That would make it easier. But yeah. I feel like queen of the world from up here. Queen of the laggy world. Um, yeah. So... I guess that's really all I have to say. Um, it this window right there. There's a lot, gonna be a lot of background noises, like cars and stuff. I don't know. And also my family in the other rooms. I'm literally in like the corner of my room right now, as you can tell by this. So anyway, happy early 4th of July to people who celebrate it, to people who, who don't, um, I'm sorry, and I love you anyway, just have a great day on the 4th of July, I don't know. Um, I am, in fact, going to be posting a vlog of the 4th of July, I am going to start vlogging, and I actually have a lot of other vlogs that I have filmed and have not gotten the chance. Okay. Because I have a real face slash voice in them, and I didn't want to leak it yet because I wasn't prepared for the reveal, which obviously is right now. In one, it's actually the vlog where I bought this flower that is now stuck on my wall. It's a big rose one. It's really pretty. And yeah, I'm obviously, well, I'm not going to post the vlog where we bought that very soon because it has my little brother's face in it that I leaked accidentally, and he doesn't want his face revealed yet. How I, so I may not post that one soon, but I have some other really cool ones that I'm going to post. Anyway, thank you all for watching. I'm going to sign off now. Love you all so much. Please subscribe. I want to see how many subscribers we can get me to. Again, I'm still going to post content about other things besides gaming. But um, I'm so glad that I finally got to do this. Thank you all for how much you've supported me along the way to this. Um... Uh, bye, guys.